what we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys how to deal with uh, messing around in um, that, with that plugin. And uh, what I mean by that is we're gonna dump a game, and it's gonna be off of a le legit. You know, I have my little actual games that I want to play without the cart for whatever reason. My little collection here, uh, all my PS Vita. I don't. I didn't do the uh, Vita to SD card mod because I just. I don't know. I, I don't play it too much. Yes, Ring Kagura. <laughs> you got a Persona 4 Golden. I'm a Persona boy, so I have just bought all the. Uh, Fate Extra. I love the Fate series. It's amazing. I'm probably going to do some anime reviews on that as well. Full Sacrifice. I haven't played enough. Rayman Origins. I know this is a small game, so we're going to do this one for the sake of time. And I'll go over it a couple times so you guys can understand how to use this plugin properly after you install it. We're not really going to talk about installing it, I'll make that a separate video, but this is just because I literally had to scour the internet for maybe about an hour, and that, that's annoying, you know what I mean? Uh, to learn how to install a plugin a plug and how to get it working to be able to dump it. So uh, let's get started, classes and stuff. Boom. Alrighty, let's, uh, let me see. So you want to go to Vita Shell. Actually, first thing you want to do, put the game in. Rayman Origins. Rayman Orange is in here. Hey, was there a problem with it? Huh. And this, by the way, before you guys get any ideas, this is actually an update. Um, I had an update for this one for apparently one character. This one, one character was functioning right. Um, like I can definitely play these, but I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. This is not me buying the game and installing it when I actually have the cart. That's stupid. Um, anywho, I guess I can't use Rayman Origins for some reason. So I guess we're going to do Metal Gear Solid. And, uh, maybe there's a problem. I just... Anywho, do it in real time because I want to make sure... So. Alright, so pop in. Go gear. Okay. Load in. Okay, so the game is in, right? Now, if you know a little bit about Vita Shell, I'm gonna pop into Vita. Alright. So trophies. I don't know why that comes up, but that's been happening with the version of you. Alrighty, so GRO is is these are all kind of like take a look at them like drives, partition. GRO or GRO GRO zero. This is the game card that's in. So the first thing you want to do is actually copy the game over to your main EXO. Yep, to EXO. So you start off, you go to GRO, X, down to app. This is inside the actual game card itself. All of this, you, this, this is the actual game. So this is getting into the game card, right? GRO. Then you go to the app folder, and this is the game itself. So triangle and you move it just copies it it's not you can't move it off the cart um, so then you go to UXO you go to the app folder in UXO you really put these anywhere but I like to keep and you press triangle right so this right here is gonna take some time um, because it's uh, it has to actually transfer the game over I think this Bigger than all the games. I would have hit me. I think this took like 10 minutes. Alright, so um, I want to show you something real quick. This, this has started happening. I'm not sure exactly why, but I've noticed that it hasn't really made any difference. Like, it's just one of those things that just pops up. Uh, I'll look it up later, but literally makes no difference. So, like, it hit 99, and if you see this error, don't even worry about it because the game, it still works fine. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> look weird with my mouth in the shadow uh, but it still works fine so hit x and the only thing i did just to recap is i copied the game from the cart and i put it 
in um, UXO app, okay? And uh, today's the 23rd, 11.21, so right here is the game, 11.10, right? Cool, so we hit serve, we'll back up. And then what you wanna do now is with that plugin, the non-PDRM, right? No, no problem. Um, all right, so you hit that folder, and uh, actually, I don't need this. It's just from an older game. Alrighty. So all we did was we copied the game from the cart to the system. Okay. Basement. Oh wow, that's bad. How'd that happen? Hold on. I have a twelve. I had twelve gigs. This game isn't. That's five gigs. Oh God. Okay. All right. Well, nah, I'll fix it. Anywho. Um. Alrighty. So, what we got to do now is just start the game. So we copied it from the game cart to the system, and we're just gonna start it. If we start the game. That'll actually generate a license. Really, actually, just like that. Now, quit the game. Um. Then we're gonna go to. All right, with that. We're gonna go back to Vita Shell. Hmm. Yep. Do -do -do. All right, so we pop back into Vita Shell, and we're gonna go down back to the No DRM the License folder. Change. Three. That's the license. This well, that's the license folder for the game. See me? You remember that if you don't. And this is the actual license. So triangle. Rename the license. Work. Dot B. W. O. A. Okay. Cool. Turn key. Triangle. Move this. Taking it out of this. Circle the back up, go back to UX, the main directory, All right? Go to your app, go to the game, which is funny. Now, this isn't all of them. What you're looking for, this one, SCE, Sony Computer Entertainment System, right? And from here, pretty sure it was package. Yep. And with all the other bins, just drop this in. Paste. Done. Now all you do is hit circle a couple times. Triangle, and you refresh the live area, which is the first option is always highlighted when you hit triangle. X. Again. Hmm. Whoops. Sorry, guys. Stop audio. No? Alright. Refreshed. Cool. Now, I'll show you guys, right? Hit. Home button. Gonna pop into Vita, take the card out. All right? So Metal Gear Solid's out. And just in case, because I'm not trying to get a copyright. Uh now go to the game. And if I hit X, this should run. As long as there's no no space issue. And we're done. That's pretty much it. I just backed up my game. Alright, let me See, no, no card in here, and uh, this is just that best report.